Now, Auckland's Deputy Mayor Penny Hulse joins us to talk more about that Auckland plan which has been brought in. The idea there, as we've just heard, user pays, every bin paid for individually. So what's the ballpark cost going to be? Because that's what people will be waking up this morning wanting to know. They are. To the individuals. So we're looking at a standardised cost across the entire region of about $150, $160. And then people will pay for the lift after that. So whether they use their bin um, once a fortnight or once a month or just a couple of times a year, then they'll just pay for the lift. Once a month, that would get a bit smelly, wouldn't it? Now, um, just to ask, uh, we already pay for our rubbish, of course, through our rates, so therefore the rates are going to come down in order to balance this out? Indeed. And that's the key thing. I think we need to remember this is about managing our costs and managing our costs across Auckland and actually reducing them. There are some good savings in this new system. So It is, however, going to cost some people more, isn't it? It is. At the moment, some people pay entirely through their rates. In Auckland City, people pay about $260 a year in their rates, regardless of whether they produce 2 kilograms of rubbish a month or 20 kilograms of rubbish a month, which is a bit inequitable. Out in Waitakere, for instance, we pay a sum total of about $56 a year, and then we pay by bags. So there are a whole lot of different ways of doing this. Some people will want to know potentially how much more this is going to cost them than the present system, given that, say, they still put their bin out once a week and they're recycling out once a fortnight, as is the system in, in certainly in Auckland City. Indeed. So they'll their costs are actually managed by the amount of rubbish that they produce. So the bottom line is to save yourself money, produce less rubbish. And that's what we've got the next three years to work on. We've got three years to help people learn to recycle better, to compost and to reduce their amount of rubbish. But how much would it cost me to put a, my bin out once a week and my recycling out once a fortnight? How much more would it cost me than the present system if I live in, in Auckland City? If you live in Auckland City, you're currently paying $260. You'll be paying about a 150 straight up and then you'll be paying I think in the region of I think we're looking at just over two dollars a lift so you can work it out yourself it then depends how many times you put your bin out for sure now we want to focus on zero waste this is in our Absolutely. waste management plan so why charge for recycling the recycling, there's a, there's a cost associated with picking up the recycling, but that's funded through your rates. So the only component where there's a direct user pays, in other words, based on the amount that you produce, is for the rubbish. And currently, in our rubbish bins and bags around the region, 50% is actually either recyclable or compostable, and we need to get that out of the waste stream and all for recycling and composting. So at the moment, we're looking at driving down the amount of waste that goes to landfill. We actually produce twice the height of the Sky Tower. If you filled Eden Park, it would go up two Sky Towers worth. That's what we produce a year. That's simply not good enough. It's expensive and it's ruining the environment. And as we saw on that clip, it's actually filling up gullies and valleys yeah. in our region. And that needs to stop. Can you just reassure me that revenue gathering is not a motive behind these new, uh, these new policies? Absolutely for not. It's cost recovery. Right. Rubbish is expensive to put in the ground. We need to manage those costs going forward. This is about driving our volumes down and looking after our environment. All right, Penny Hulse from, from the uh, Deputy Mayor of Auckland, thank you very much. Now, thank there are a load of other smaller concerns which I have about people putting rubbish into other people's sure. bins, etc. We can find that on the website if you want to go there for, slightly more, for, for some other answers. And we've got three years to work this through with our community and resolve those issues with them. All right, thanks very much, Penny. Lovely, thank you.